Yo guys, what's going on? This is Tony here, and today I have the uh, Prince Jousting Challenge. Um, I know that these like challenges are kind of like hit or miss with you guys. Like some of you don't really even bother with them, but uh, I was th I was thinking, you know what? For the my subs that do actually uh, play these challenges, I'll make a video, show you guys a really strong deck. Uh, this is obviously the deck. It's a very log bait deck. Uh, I mean, obviously with all the princes, you kind of need a lot of swarm. So obviously, Skarmy, Skeletons, Tombstoners are your main swarm. Skelly Barrel just to help uh, with the bait aspect, and then Princess Dark Gob, Gob Barrel are all just to, to, to like fulfill the bait aspect and chip the towers down. So uh, that's the deck currently five and zero. Oh. Um, I mean, I'm just gonna play the like finish this out four games, it's not too bad. So uh, I'm just gonna hop straight in, and I'll be back with the first game. Okay, so here we go, guys. We got the first game. Good luck, thumbs. Um, I'm just gonna Goblin Barrel first play. Let's see what he's got. Um, okay, I actually put that on the wrong side, whoops. <laughs> I forgot which side the uh, princes go down. But, um, okay, cannons, I have tombstone. We're, uh, we're just chilling. Okay, so he guards, so I do want a princess, get the, get my defense ready. Um, this deck, you cycle princesses a lot. It's an interesting goblin bear. I'm just gonna let my princess die, because I think he'll activate king. Yep, perfect. Okay, so awesome. Uh, I can dark gob. I'm gonna, hmm, I'm gonna... Skeletons and then Dark Gob. So, Dark Gob here and the Skeletons as well. And then that Prince is completely taken out. He wastes a Tombstone on defense. He's got an Ice Whiz. Um, so I'm just going to log his Ice Whiz here to help my Dark Gob. Okay, well, he actually uh, he has a log of his own. So I'll ske I'm going to Skelly Barrel and then I'm going to um, Goblin Barrel as well to support. Um... Okay, so a prince or the cannon helps with his prince. We're just gonna tombstone on defense again. Cycle another princess. Log here in a bit. Um, actually no, he has gob barrel. Okay, so he logs himself. There's the goblin barrel. There's the log. Get the skeletons down. And now I'm just gonna keep chipping slowly but surely, guys. So another princess in the back. Um, we're just gonna tombstone again. I could skelly barrel. And then I'm going to throw another Dark Gob and then Skeletons to help protect him. Um, oh, okay, well, game's closing in five minutes, boys. Okay, I guess I'll have to finish this, uh, finish this uh, video after, but that's fine. Um, we definitely could finish this game. I mean, you guys can see the power of this deck. He's, he's not going anywhere. He literally has touched my tower with, like, I think, like a spell. But other than that, he just hasn't done anything. So we're going to Goblin Barrel... And then we're gonna skelly barrel and we're just we're just gonna keep chipping him down. Oh he completely has just let the tower go, hasn't he? Yep, let's go boys. Okay, so there's the tower. And then once you take a tower, as long as like your towers aren't in like spell range, you just wanna defend. So uh, I'm just gonna keep cycling princesses, cycling goblin barrels, even like a skarmy to uh, help protect my stuff. Goblin barrel, skelly barrel, I mean just throw everything at him and literally yep, there you go. There's nothing you can do, he gave up. Easy three cam, good first game. Um, since the game is closing, I'll uh, have to have to put a pause button here. But uh, we'll be back once the game is up for the uh, seventh match. Okay, guys, we're back. Maintenance break is over. It's about an hour later, um, but we are back here at six and zero. Uh, we're gonna hop straight in, get the seventh dub. So let's see. Okay, we got Mr. Ed. Good luck, thumbs. Um, we're just gonna tombstone the first play to uh, catch the initial prince that drops, so there's the prince. Um, and if you guys notice that the clouds are actually now gone, so that's interesting. Um, okay, Skarmy, Log, Princess, that should clean up enough, but uh, back to what I was saying, the clouds, it, like in the back, they used to be blocking your troops, or like, like you wouldn't be able to see what troops they placed, but now they've just removed them, so uh, that's cool. You know, fixing the map, at least they uh, did it. Um, you, they actually, there's still a little issue with it, but it's fine. It's not as bad, so, uh, anyway, we're just gonna keep tombstoning against these princes, and then I'm gonna, okay, wow, he's got barbs, it's a big elixir, uh, commitment here. Oh, oh, I missed, oh my, okay, that's bad. Um, yikes, okay, so I took a good amount of, good amount of hits from that prince, I did screw up my, um, uh, my tombstone, god, I forgot what it was called. Anyway, we got all three going in. Um, I'm going to princess as well and skeletons. Hopefully a prince charge on the tower. Okay, we'll take a prince charge on the lumberjack. 
that tower is going to go down. Scar me just to protect um, from my t uh, my tower from the prince. And then we're going to go in with the Goblin Barrel Skelly Barrels. And that's even better now that he wasted his log. We're going to actually go in for a Dark Goblin also. And then a log. Okay, it might be not. Oh, oh, man. That was not overzealous. That was gorgeous. Uh, skeletons to tank the princes. Skeleton army. We got another princess here in just a second. And then I have a tombstone at the ready. So there's the tombstone. Um, ooh. Okay, so we got caught by a log. We're going to Goblin Barrel Defense. And then skeletons on defense. And then skeleton army on defense. Uh, oh, I have nothing. I have literally nothing over here on this lane. So we're going to tombstone after logging. Um, I guess princess. Skeletons. Oh my god, this defense. And then that's that's all cleaned up, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Wow, what a, what a defense there. So um, skeleton barrel to support an offense. Just to log to clean all this up. Um, unfortunately, the princes were back there charging. Uh, princess to clean up the Skarmy. And then... Oh, they split. That's actually funny. Uh, and then Tombstone, Dark Gob. Uh, to just keep help cleaning up on defense. Another Goblin Barrel. Another Skeleton Barrel. So you guys can see the amount of pressure you can output with this deck. So, just like that. Another 3 Crown. Uh, here in just a second. Yep, he can't defend. Lovely. Another 3 Crown. 7-0. and oh, Really strong deck. Um... I did take more damage that game. Uh, he he had a better matchup like with the log. If they have log, it's actually kind of hard because you can't just stack up like princesses and stuff. So uh, it was a little more difficult, but we got the dub. That's what's important. Uh, let's hop straight into this next match. See who we uh, get matched up with. So we got uh, Durton. I don't know. Probably butchered the name. <laughs> eh, he'll never find that. <laughs> uh, anyway, Goblin Barrel. Oh, I did it again. Right into the prince. It's a bad habit. I gotta stop doing that. Um, okay, so he splits a Skarmy. Interesting. I wish I had Princess. Oh, he splits Bats as well. I really wish I had a Princess. Um, but Tombstone with Dark Gob should be enough here, so... Tombstone with Dark Gob. Cleaning up. I'm gonna log just to keep damage off and kill this Princess. Lovely. Cool. Okay, so we're chilling. Um, I could have Skelly Barreled, but I think he might just have, like, a log or something, so... Okay, Val gets much worse. Uh, Skeletons hide just to drag the Valk back. Tombstone to help uh, on defense. I need this Valk to die before the Tombstone dies. Oh, that did not go very well. Skarmy. Oh, that Prince is getting a charge. Okay, so one charge from the Prince. Not, not game over. Um, never fun to be down early, but it's okay. I can log the Firecracker, keep my Princess alive. Um, okay, Princesses are going to trade shots at each other. I got Skeletons. Just to defend, and then I have Dark Op. Uh, he's got a Mega Knight, interesting. Um, I'm gonna let my Princess die here, and then my Dark Op should clean up uh, his Firecracker. Oh, god, one shot less than I needed. Okay, just log then. Uh, and then I have another Princess. Um, I'm gonna go for a Skelly Barrel Goblin Barrel just because I have a little bit of elixir right now, so we'll see what he's got. Um, okay, Valk, we'll play. And then I can Dark Op. This tombstone with princess is going to clean up nicely. So I'm going to just log on defense. Hit the princess. Oh, we missed the princess. Guys, we're, we're playing bad. I'm not going to lie. We're playing playing pretty rusty. But it's fine. That all, oh, wow. The two princess shots just cleaned up like everything. Okay, we're good. Yeah, yeah. This princess on the right is doing great. I got skeletons everywhere. Um, She's dead. I'm not going to be able to save her. So just a log is fine. And then another princess. I mean, oh, oh, the left side. The left side just fell. Literally, it just he, he he looked away for like a second and just fell. Oh my. Okay, well we got another goblin barrel going in, another skelly barrel. We're just applying all the pressure, aren't we? Um, I got a dark gob going in on the left with the tombstone to help support. Uh, I'm just gonna log to kill these princes or help kill these princes rather. Um, princess number two is alive. Uh, Skarmy princess cleans up. I'm going to skelly barrel again. I got princes everywhere. I got princes and princesses. This is funny. <laughs> um, so we got both our barrels popping. Log. Oh, man, he collapsed. He collapsed just like that. That was out of nowhere, and all of a sudden, I just three crown him. This deck is crazy, and it's really hard to, like, talk through it. But we got the dub. That's what's important. 8-0. One more. Finish this out. And, uh, okay, get the princes. My princess is already maxed, so it doesn't really matter, but we'll take the gold. Um, let's get this legendary chest and uh, see what we can get. Okay, so game nine, here we go. 
good luck thumbs. Um, split skellies. Let's see what he's got. Okay, well, I knew the prince was coming, but let's see what else he has to do. Um, I'm debating if I should dark up in tombstone. Oh, okay, he burned a uh, he burned a log. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go a little overzealous. Um, okay, so we caught actually like half the skarmy with our log, so that was good. Prince looks to be getting a hit on the tower. Yes, nice. Um, I'm just gonna princess and then skellies. Uh, to clean up the ewes. Okay, good poison. Good poison. Actually, wait. No. Okay, good poison. Uh, tombstone, just to, so that I don't care if that it's in the poison, but the skellies don't like end, uh, end in the poison because like that would be bad. So, dark gob cleans up the prince. I'm going to go for a goblin barrel uh, with dark gob. Okay, I was gonna say tanking, but he wasted the log. Um, we should get a. Oh, I was gonna say a couple hits, but we got literally none. Um, princess on defense. Prince uh, is charging. I have a skarmy on this side. Um. Skeleton's just split in the back. He skellies. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I don't really have anything. I'm just going to skelly bro this lane and god bro this lane. Just cycle another princess, honestly. Okay, get the log out. Uh, our princess lives. Nice. That's huge. Oh, that's huge. She's still alive. Okay, we got a dark gob, skelly barrel, skeleton army. We got two princes on that side. Oh my god, I got stuff everywhere. Uh, he logs. Okay, we'll play log and catch the dark gob. I'm gonna goblin barrel. Um, princess cleans up another skarmy. He's gonna have that firecracker alive like a long time, but it's fine. We are definitely winning, so I'm gonna log the firecracker, keep my princess alive. Um, tombstone. Uh, oh no, he. I did not see a loon coming. Skeleton army with my princess. I would love to get another tombstone down here. Go. Okay, I think we activate King with this. Uh, oh no, we screwed it up. It's fine. Oh my God, so much going on right now. I'm going to. Oh, that was a bad. That was a bad guy, bro. Oh, okay. No, but we caught it all. Okay, that's good damage. We'll take that. Um, he's got two princes. I'm basically two logs away from the win here. He wastes his log, so I can Skarmy, Dark Gob, and Princess, and then I can Tombstone High just to keep it out of the poison. The right tower falls. I didn't even see that. Uh, skeleton or. Er... Uh, Goblin Barrel, I don't have anything for the Skarmy, yeah. Princess in the Pocket, okay, uh, Tower went down anyway. Um, just another Dark Gob, a couple more Skarmies, a Tombstone, and that's the game. So, you guys can see this deck, I mean, it's really hard to commentate with it just because of how fast-paced it is. But, I mean, you can see that it works, like, I absolutely steamrolled almost everybody here. Like, I didn't quite through crown that guy, but I don't think I lost a single tower, you know, we're gonna go, we're gonna look back. And see if I lost a single tower in these, uh, oh, I guess these three games. Because the other one got cut off and I played a little ladder, so. Uh, three crown, three crown, and a two crown with zero crowns lost. I'll go glance at it. Um, okay, yeah, so then a three crown, and that one with zero crowns lost as well. So there you guys go. In this video, I did not lose a single crown, and I took literally 11, so. I mean, you could, you could see the power. Um, let's open this ledger chest for you guys. I think I'm going to get an Ice Wiz. I want a log, but I think I'm getting an Ice Wiz. Uh, okay, so Graveyard. I'll take a Graveyard. That's fine. Graveyard is uh, halfway to max now, so that's cool. Um, there we go. Uh, that's the challenge. The Prince's Joust, as the, uh, the game calls it. But uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe. Hope this helped, and I uh, hope you can get the uh, nine wins with it, with this deck, that is. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and have a nice day.